Hi, my name is Greg Stevens and I'm the Chief of the Army Medical Department Civilian Corps. I'm proud to be one of the 40,000 plus civilians who serve Army Medicine on a day-to-day -day basis. I'd like you to meet some of our other team members, specifically those who have volunteered for and been selected for our Board of Advisors for the AMED Civilian Corps. When you hear them talk about team, you'll understand that Army Medicine truly is our profession and we truly are serving to heal and honored to serve. Tell us what you do. Uh, well, I'm a clinical psychologist and I'm an Army leader and I provide clinical services but I also uh, work for the people who have supposedly work for me. My job is to help them do their jobs better as we serve our soldiers and their families. I'm the Chief of Occupational Health at Tripler Army Medical Center. I'm also the, the consultant for occupational medicine in the Pacific region. I am the Public Affairs Officer for Keller Army Community Hospital at West Point. And my primary role there is to tell the Army medicine story. And that's the story of responsive and reliable health care advancing wellness, improving the health and wellness of our soldiers, and making sure that everyone out there knows that we are, one, the leader in healthcare, and two, the go-to person for research and innovation. I'm an attorney for the AMED Center and School. Um, there's two components to the AMED Center and School. One is the school piece. Uh, there was a previous general that described it as, we make medics. Now, perhaps that's an oversimplification, but it's something that Again, someone like myself that's a non-medical person can remember. That's the purpose of what we do. We have a single driven purpose. We make medics. We train doctors, we train nurses, and that's what we do here. Well, the other half is the center part. That's where we do the, the, the thought leading, the, the research, the innovation, you know, developing and shaping our force. And so what I do is I provide legal advice so that those folks are able to make that happen. Sonographer, it, uh, we uh, part of radiology. Uh, most people know us by uh, the babies. <laughs> oh. I'm an operations and training specialist for uh, the White David Eisenhower Army Medical Center, the Warrior Transition Battalion. I, um, I do taskings, I do training for civilians and uh, the military members and also the soldiers. I help them get into their transition mode after they heal and during their healing. I work in the Department of Emergency Medicine and I feel blessed every day coming to take care of our soldiers and their families. I work very hard um, encouraging my entire team to do the best that they can do every day and provide safe and timely care for our patients and make sure that they're taken care of. As a civilian, I'm the Force Health Protection Manager at Ireland Army Community Hospital, the Fort Knox Medic. As the Force Health Protection manager, I manage deployability for the soldiers under our region. I'm a behavioral health provider at Fort Rucker. I'm a pharmacist and I've been a pharmacist for mm, uh, a few decades. Let's go there. I am a senior HR specialist within um, the AMED Personnel Proponent Directorate. My main mission is to um, uh, stay focused on the training dollars that uh, Army G3 uh, provides to us. I'm the Assistant Deputy Commander for Clinical Services at Darnell. That's the Assistant Chief Medical Officer at Darnell Army Medical Center. I'm a family physician by training.